Welcome back to the Money Pot with Tim Davies, yours truly, keeping it real. And Timmy here today as well. Awesome, at a secret beach. Come with us, let's go. It's a 30, 40 foot drop. This is a chance of a lifetime, these cuts. Check this out, guys. Well, as you can see, the water's still coming up here and uh, we're, not, we're nowhere near ready. But anyway, I'm still trying to take it in how big a cut there is here. This is just awesome. Once in a lifetime cut for metal detecting people like me and Timmy. And thanks for Timmy and his old man, Timmy Freddo, for letting me into their secret beach that they've been doing for 30 years. Here's a little picture of Tim and his old man. 20 years ago here. Well, me and Timmy are ready to go. Timmy's got the mine lab 3030 with the big, big massive coil. Massive coil. I've got the Excalibur and Timmy's old man will be here later with the Excalibur as well. Let's jump in there and see what we can find. Awesome. Let's do it. Timmy, I found it! Freddo, man! I'm here with Mr. Freddo, Timmy Freddo. He let me come down to his beach today, him and his son, Tim, my best mate. And uh, this is a secret. Uh, he's let us onto it. I've come down here and look at this, guys, a beautiful goldie. Yeah. Now, that's what we're looking for. So, there we go. Now, this, uh, this man here has been doing this for like 30, 40 years with his son. And uh, I'll tell you what, Mr. Freddo, it's a privilege for you to let me down here and uh, let me onto your little secret beach. But I'll tell you what, just, just try and absorb this, guys. Look at, look at this. And that's his son down there, Timmy Freddo. We're raking up the twos, we're raking up the ones. And there's the hole uh, for a beautiful gold ring. That's how easy it is sometimes. So awesome. Let's just keep tracking and I'll let you know when I come across our next ring. Let's keep going, boys. Ridiculous amounts of one cent coins and two cent coins. So you gotta just dig everything. Because that gold ring was coming up like a one cent coin or a two cent coin. Two bucks, that's what we like to see. Little ones, hundreds of little ones.
Sinker, sinker. I'll tell you what, I'll give you a listen. But there's just buzzers everywhere. Buzzers everywhere. just started hitting the pennies as well so I know Timmy's found a few pennies and I just found a couple just then as well If I hadn't persisted with those small ones, I wouldn't have got the ring. I know, I didn't try to stop going down there, I didn't think it was big enough. Well guys, we've spent about four hours down there and uh, we've just cleaned up. This is real treasure hunting, keeping it real. Me and Timmy, uh, we've scored about probably 10, 12 rings or something. So keeping you excited and then holding you back for a little bit. So keeping it real, me and Timmy, come and check out what we found, guys. This is what the CTX 3030 found. That big pile there. And here's Timmy's jewelry just here. Couple of gold ones there, nice. And to the Excalibur, bit of a chain there. I don't think that's gold. Looks like copper. Looks like copper. And 
those couple of crud rings, a little gold ring just there, some twos and ones. And uh, story of the day was this big bad boy. And it's stuck on my finger now, I can't get it off. But that's right, we'll get that off tonight. But between two machines, all day. Timmy, what do you reckon? Not a bad effort, I reckon. Not a bad effort. We got a few people having a look at our treasure that we've just found. And uh, I'm not gonna tell you where we are. If you work it out, all good for you. But this is a secret beach and uh, we're gonna keep it a secret for a little while. Uh, thanks for joining me and Tim again for the money pot. Stick around for our next adventure. See you guys. See ya. It's awesome, isn't it, guys? I can't believe how much is cut out here. Um, Timmy, just go walk over there and so we can get a good idea of how much has been cut out of there. And That's look at that. Good. You wouldn't believe it, would you? Let me just walk back a little bit more. I mean, the entrance is well and truly gone. Above Timmy's head, Old chappy up there looking at us, he can't get down here, nor would you want to get down here. The waves have been coming up here most of the day. We're on low tide at the moment, so I've got a bit of a break. And uh, you've just seen what we found already. So now we're going to go for a second bash. So, give it another bash before dark. I've got my lights anyway, but at night time when this tide comes back in and again, mate, I'll tell you what, the big waves come in, there's nowhere to grab so you're screwed and uh, some big shrapnel out there so we've got to be careful still anyway and uh, hang with us guys 